As a dog owner, I would just like to say, even when you're not expecting it, there's always a poop bag in one of your pockets. I don't know how it ends up there, it just does. So today is actually the last day of driving school for Kayla and I, and we've been doing it the last two weekends. So four classes each, and they've been five hours long, and I can't even tell you how long it feels, because at the end of the class, my ass is so sore from just sitting in those chairs. I'm so happy this is gonna be done. And then we have in-class, like in-car driving lessons, so <sighs> trying to get that cheaper insurance. Grabbed Kayla, and we are heading into driving school right now. And I was getting kind of nervous because I was messaging her and she wasn't answering and then my mom called her a couple times and I was like, I'm going to have to bust her door down or I'm gonna have to like go to her window and I'm gonna have to... Oh well, that's a little concerning. Um, and then I was like, I'm gonna have to figure out which window's hers to knock on it, so yeah. But yeah, see you guys after this. Because of the reduced visibility, it's vitally important to slow down and stay slowed down. Also, Kayla and I are officially done driving school. We just need to do the in class now, like the in car lessons. What is that saying he kept saying? He was a bit iffy, our teacher. Cause like even like the one where you have to like replace the tire, he's like only get under the car if you have wood. And that thing clearly said don't get under the car. Like, uh, he was an interesting one. Hopefully that's not us in our driving test, Kayla. Just got it, you guys. I decided to change, get a little bit more comfy. I'm wearing PJs. I haven't worn PJs in like forever. And my mom is just at the bank quickly. She dropped me off. And then we are going to watch. Mills, what are you doing? And this is a problem. This little shithead is getting up on my bed now. Huh? You know you're not supposed to be up there. Come on, let's go. My mom and I are just gonna relax for the rest of the day because it is Mother's Day and yeah, it's her day. So we're just gonna chill. I'm gonna spend the rest of the day with her and yeah. We're gonna catch up on some Riverdale. I got her two mugs for Mother's Day from Tim Hortons. This is their, I think, 100th or something year. And then I also got the, or it's their 150th year. And then I got her this one as well. This one's my favorite because it has like maple syrup and trees and like toques and such Canadian things on it. I love it. I have officially booked Kayla and I in for driving lessons on Tuesday. So tomorrow when I upload this, it'll be the next day for you guys. So tomorrow, hopefully everything goes well Tuesday. Fingers crossed for us. I'll let you know how it goes. So this is the other, I got the travel mug for my mom. Do you like it, Mom? That's my mommy. I love her. You're so good too. You're so cute. I'm just You're like a little shiitake. You're like a little shiitake. Are you serious? You're hurting my cheeks. <laughs> if it looks like I just got my lips did, it's cause they're swollen for some reason. I don't know if I ate something that I'm allergic to, but I doused them in Vaseline. And the upper lip hurts like hell. This is a cute look for me. Is this a cute look? It looks like I got my lips done. Like, what? I'm just sitting here, I'm comfy. So is he, he found a new place to nap. Yup. Look at him, he's being rude. He thinks my bed's his bed, he thinks my body is his bed. Ow, oh. oh. Oh, you're cute though. Look at him, mommy, he's a freaking shiitake. My mom and I just got done watching the last two episodes of Riverdale. Holy shit. Spoiler alert right now, because I'm gonna talk about it. First off, the second last episode, I could not believe that the baby was a blossom and that Betty's family were blossoms, but the name was changed, so it was incest, but they were like third cousins, and Polly's pregnant with blossoms, but she's a blossom too. Oh my god, like that was mind blowing. And then the gunshot at the end. Holy crap, I cannot believe that happened. I cannot believe that. And then I thought Archie got shot, but it was his dad. It was made to look like it wasn't intended, however, it totally was intended. It had something to do with Veronica's dad, for sure. And then Jughead's a serpent now. Kevin's boyfriend left because he was gonna get caught for like stuff. And no, so, like my one question is where the hell is Miss Grundy? I understand she left, but she has something to do with something. She's coming back, I know she is. And then Betty has a secret brother. Like I need to know when the next season is starting. <laughs> like I'm so like I'm into the next season completely. But yeah, guys, 
I'm getting ready for bed. It is about 10 p.m. now, way past my bedtime in my opinion. And yeah, I'm gonna sleep on my new pillows tonight. Is that Beyonce? I think it is Beyonce. Oh damn, girl. What did you think of Riverdale? I think uh, there's more to it. Yes. I think Veronica Lodge's mother is uh, an evil killer. Just her. Everyone, all the I parents, think, all the parents in the show think, are f***ed up. I think she actually hung Jason Blossom. No, dad. she didn't. Give yes, me a break. Did. Remember, guys, at the end of the day, there's always what? A reason to smile. Get a queen. What's a queen? Queen. Queen. What's that mean? Oh my god. <laughs> What's that mean? <laughs> What's the round boat? <laughs> I can't believe I'm related to her. <laughs>